We are back and at Camp T. We should rebuff. Get another speak to someone at Crossroads quest here. I will be so glad when you can get mounts to 20, I'll tell you. Barrens is going to be one of the largest areas you will find in the whole of Azeroth, and it comes as the uh, the one that, uh, that 10 to 20 area. Maybe 10 to 25, maybe. But, uh, yeah, mounts are definitely useful in times like this when you don't have the flight pass. Mind you, we're at level 13, not at a level 20. So, and we will reach level 20 probably long before the patch comes out. So, I'm not too worried about that. Just a wishful thinking on my part. Oh, uh, I wanted to let you know the stopwatch is running because uh, videos are limited to uh, 20 minutes here. So I kind of have to watch myself. Uh, some of the uh, videos that are still have yet to load, uh, I had to actually break into two parts because they were too long to fit in the, under that 10 minute limit. So you'll see an A and a B under there and that's why. And sometimes you'll get so caught up on there you'll, you'll or at least I will not notice that the stopwatch has gone over 10 minutes. But that's okay. I mean, that's what we have editors for. You know, we can find Mancrick's wife even before we find Mancrick. That's, that's funny. Mind you, I don't think we could beat anything in there. I think it's level 16, 17. And we're in level 5 gear. <laughs> Now, as I mentioned before, the uh, the gear is pretty bad, um, but the uh, the quests that we uh, need to get to get the good gear, some of it's going to require more action than I would like. For instance, the uh, the quest to kill the Striders, uh, you gotta that takes long enough with one person, but with two, it just takes forever. But we got to do it to uh, find other quests that uh, have a little bit better reward to, to them. Uh oh, I'm about to lose. Move it. Okay, we we'll caught up here. And you got to keep an eye on the uh, the mini map here, and uh, you can see how far away your partner is getting. But yeah, we have to. I wish we could uh, just take the quest where you can kill numbers of things and leave it at that, but uh, that doesn't always work. For instance, there is a quest there where you have to get centaur uh, bracers. That takes forever. And yet it's a very low level quest. So by the time you, even one person gets enough bracers, it's, uh, you know, it's a great quest already. So I've never figured that out. But overall, I do uh, enjoy playing Warcraft. Even more so since I started dual boxing, because uh, normally I, I quest alone, and this uh, this makes it easier for me, especially with PvP. I mean, people are more likely to to attack you in PvP when you're by yourself. Of course, gankers you can't avoid those, no matter how many of them, of, of you there are. And the nice thing about uh, Carbonite here is it tells me up ahead that I've got quests I need to turn in, and of course this is the one for the, the defense, so... Don't want to kill raptors until we actually get the quest to get their heads. And the nice thing about that quest is it's, it's a 100% drop. Problem is finding the raptors that are at, at your level. 
I mean, I know where there's a lot of raptors, but they're, uh, they're all level 16, 17, 18 raptors. This one, for instance, is level 15. A little bit uh, ahead of where I want to be. But those level 11, 12, 13 raptors are hard to find. Mostly we want to take the quest where you kill certain numbers of things, uh, delivery quests, uh, there's a quest to, uh, to explore certain areas, and those are the ones that give us the most XP for our, our money, so to speak, or for our time, I should say. Alright, we are at the crossroads. Peace to you too. All right. And gee, we have a quest to go back to uh, Thunder Bluff. And we're too low level from Ancrick. Oh no. Of course, there's the Striders. Let's go ahead and get the flight path. And just remember to get it for both your players. It's very easy to forget that. And I've found that out the hard way. Alright, let's go up here. These two. Yeah, yeah. I don't usually do supplies for the crossroads until we get the second part of the uh, disruption must end. we can get here. Oh yes, the mushrooms. And the trip to Ratchet. This is the quest that forces us to go back to Thunder Bluff. Hail the U2. Yeah, that's it. And they do this because they want you to know that there's a flight path there. It's simple, plain and simple. Alright. Uh, yeah. We are going to go ahead and do that because we are approaching the end of our 10 minute time limit. And we're going to fly to Thunder Bluff. But. We have not reached 14 yet. These little delivery quests, they just, they're nice uh, when you're doing it solo. They're even nicer when you're getting triple XP for it. Alright, let us go to Thunder Bluff. Thank you for the bluff. Uh, buff, I should say. Okay, we got that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, we're going to Thunder Bluff. We'll be back in just a few minutes, and thanks for watching.